Today we want to talk to you about how to share the gospel of Jesus Christ. You know, Jesus told his followers and he tells us in Mark chapter 16 that we need to go into all the world and preach the gospel of Jesus Christ. But a lot of people, they say to me, Chris, how do I preach the gospel? I know that the gospel is the power of God unto salvation for them that believe, which is what Paul tells us in Romans 1:16. But how do I communicate the gospel? And more importantly, what is the gospel that I need to preach? Well, the Bible tells us the answer to that in 1 Corinthians 15 verses 1 through 5. Paul tells the Corinthians there, he says, this is the gospel that I preach to you that Jesus Christ died for your sins, that he was buried, and that he rose again from the dead in Jesus' name. And so this is, my friend, this is the message that we need to preach all over the world. You see, the core issue with all of humanity is sin. Sin separates us from God. But the Bible tells us that God so loved the world that he sent his only begotten son, Jesus Christ, to die for our sins, to set us free from sin. You know, it doesn't matter what context that I'm preaching in. I can be in another nation. I can be preaching to people of another, another ethnicity, another religious background. But all of us realize that sin is the issue with all of humanity. And Jesus Christ came to die for the sins of the world. He's the only one who paid for our sins and he's the only one who can set us free from the sins that we commit. You know, the Bible's telling us here that as we go out telling people about Jesus, make sure that you communicate that Jesus Christ died for your sins, that he's the only one who has the power to set us free from sin and share how Jesus Christ set you free and how he paid for your sins in Jesus name. So you might be asking yourself, Chris, how is it that I get into a conversation with somebody in order to talk to them about Jesus? Well, the Lord showed me three questions when I was doing a, an evangelistic outreach several years ago that I can ask somebody, that you can ask someone in order to begin a conversation about Jesus and share the gospel with them. And these three questions are this. First, ask them what they know about Jesus. This will give you a great idea of where they're at in their walk with God. Second, ask them if you can tell them what you know about Jesus. And this gives you a great opportunity to begin to share your testimony, share how Jesus changed your life, and share the gospel of Jesus Christ. And lastly, make sure you ask the last question. Do you want to receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior? This is the most important question. You don't want to share the gospel with them and forget to ask them if they want to receive Jesus Christ. <laughs>